England. Come on. Five o'clock on a hazy English summer's afternoon. And in a pandemic, a nervous nation has to find new ways of coming together. So the picnic tables are laid out neatly in front of the screen at Trafalgar Square. The tension spreads up to Manchester, where fences mark out social distances and England miss an early chance. Another one goes begging and they can't believe it at a football club in Cambridgeshire where the crowd is on the pitch. But it's not all over. It's just half time. Over at the fan park in Berlin, the crowd is so quiet. You can hear the commentator as the game stays level deep into the second half. In Croydon, though, a rapper is ready to make some noise. Stormzy's favourite, Jack Grealish, has come onto the pitch. And in a pub in Jack's birthplace, Birmingham, they watch their boy pass it out to Luke Shaw, who crosses, and Raheem does the rest. Yes! <laughs> he did score. He did score. Yes, Prime Minister, he did score. But wait. Never count the Germans out. In Berlin, they see Thomas Muller go clean through. He must score. Oh, but he doesn't. Now, to linger on these pictures would be gloating. So let's just wait till they throw their hats on the floor. Oh, yes, there they go. And as if all that wasn't enough for them back in Birmingham. And in Cambridgeshire. And in Manchester. And in Croydon. Harry Kane nodded one home to make it 2-0. Thank you, England. We'll never forget it. Geraint Vincent, News at 10.